Hey guys, what's up? It's Fangrove, and today I have another Black Ops 3 firearm. Today we have the Weevil submachine gun that is a, I guess you could call it bullpup compact uh, due to its small design and where the receiver and magazine are. We have a very short barrel exposed but in all reality, the barrel extends all the way back to here to where the trigger is. <clears throat> Up here, we have your short Picatinny rail for your iron sights and other scopes that you'd wanna, you know, equip. Over here on the side, we have your charging handle. Down here, we have an oddly designed foregrip. Then right behind that, we have the trigger. Then we have your grip for your that. Then we have a clip here at the bottom. <laughs> Moving back up to the top, we have the 50 round magazine. And we also have the release, the mag release button here. You push it, it you know pops the magazine up so you can grab it and slide it out easily. And then next, back here, we have the short stock that makes it pretty compact. In game, it's hard to tell if it's like, you know, an extracting stock, like you can pull it out and push it in. I would assume so, since it's the year 2065 when this gun's predicted to be built. <laughs> so I I'd, I'd hope that it's actually, you know, adjustable. <clears throat> That's pretty much it on the detailing of the gun. It's pretty simple. It has, let's see, 50 rounds in this little magazine. And let's see, it's got pretty moderate damage and accuracy. Like the accuracy pretty much just goes like straight up for the recoil. And let's see, the damage, it's usually like a four shots or five shots to kill, which is pretty nice for a submachine gun. Uh, this fire rate's pretty slow, it's it's pretty much a reskin of the PDW-57 from Black Ops 2. Because, you know, it was pretty balanced and that's how they saw this gun to be. Um, let's see, what else should I talk about? Uh, it's a nice little submachine gun. It's pretty popular, and I know the community has always wanted a buff for it to make it better. But it is pretty great as it is. It's just some people gotta, you know, get the feel of it because every gun has a certain feel, and you know, you can't really do well with it if you don't know how it goes. <laughs> <clears throat> well, anyways, let's set this gun down. Get an overview look at it. So yeah, this is the Weeble submachine gun from Black Ops 3. Well, let me know what you think of it, and of any ways that I could improve the design. And also feel free to leave me some uh, ideas of what I should build next. Now, I don't always, uh, you know, take people's ideas and build it as the next gun to where it's the next video. I tend to be pretty behind on when I upload videos and stuff, so... It may be like a month or two before I have the uh, recommended gun built. <laughs> so yeah, let me know what you think, and have a great day.